or at least expose yourself to them, you know, that uh, uh, I, I meet young people now and uh, I, I can see, I could foretell a lot of what the future will hold for them. Uh, I, I met people from a freshman class and I said, what are you gonna do in college? And instead of say, have fun and learn and explore, they would go, well, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get a, 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 a BA in business then I'm going to get an MBA and then I'm going to go to law school and I'm going, you know, and they had it down. I'm going to be an entertainment lawyer. I'm going to apprenticeship and I'm going, they got the next 35 years planned out. And what happens if they get there and they discover they hate being an entertainment lawyer or they hate being this, uh, you know, one of the uh, psychiatrists that I knew uh, went to law school and became a lawyer and discovered he just hated it. So he went back to medical school and became a doctor. And then he worked in a hospital and discovered he hated it. And he should have gone and hung out with doctors and find out what they do, you know? And, uh, you know, if you don't like what somebody does, then that's the wrong job for you. And, you know, most people are thinking about finding a career instead of finding a lifestyle. See, humor doesn't mean you're laughing every moment. You know, some people think, you know, if you add humor to something, you're laughing all the time. It's really about enjoyment. Uh, you may be laughing and singing on the inside and deadly serious on the outside. Uh, I asked a judge once how he kept doing this year in and year out. And he, quite frankly, he said, well, he said, I may appear to be deadly serious, but on the inside, I'm telling myself jokes every minute. And he's going, how could this guy be so stupid? You know, he goes, he's going to go to jail for 17 years for robbing $30 from some convenience store. <laughs>